Despite the presence of policemen in and around the court premises, members of the Judiciary Staff Union of Nigeria say they cannot be intimidated by forces who are bent on perverting justice. Although the gates were thrown open, no activity was taking place at the various offices except for some young men who were seen at the premises. Do some members alleged that the few workers who resumed for work came from a door north? Some of them who spoke with the news crew said that they came from Agenebode and Auchi to resume work in Benin. I'm from Auchi. The truth of the matter is that you see these people, they have their own private business. That is why they, they can even stay at home for one year without complaining. But I cannot do this. This is what I do for a living. So my, what, I, what, I, what I wanted to do, they should try and resolve it very fast so that we, we get back to work. And we are tired of sitting down of, of sitting down at home. So why didn't you resume at Agenebode that you have to come here? Yeah, because, because this place is a place where we can really talk to press and they will because you know again it's just like a rural community now the perceived strange faces at the court premises prompted the chief security officer of the high court to raise alarm as a way of protecting government property under his care since he was not too sure of who they were if anything happened they carry typewriter they carry me to stay here i get mad to talk you open door for my head to teach eh? tomorrow i say go to see here i don't i don't know my work Speaking on happenings at the State High Court, the Chairman, Judiciary Staff Union of Nigeria, Edo State, Uyi Ogieriahi, said it is shameful that members of the Judiciary Service Commission could force the gates open instead of ensuring that the union and government reach a truce. Look at a system that is supposed to operate the rule of law, taking laws into the hand. Do you know we have a matter in the National Industrial Court? We have a matter in the Federal High Court. And to inform you that we got to garnish, to garnish the account of uh, Edo State government. That is why they are trying to use the police. But we want to appreciate the police for being neutral. We are saying, even when the gates are open, our workers will not go back to work. Enough is enough. Commenting on the issue, the Edo State Attorney General and Commissioner for Justice, Barrister Henry Dabo, said they are not compelling any workers to resume, but that the doors of the court are open to any who is interested in working and why those who are on strike are at liberty to do so. On his part, the Secretary of Judiciary Service Commission, Isaac Sanu, said work has resumed in earnest. We are not compelling them. They are free to stay away, but they cannot padlock the gates leading to the high court premises because the gate and the high court premises does not belong to them. We have gone beyond breaking of key and whatever. All I need to say to you is that work has resumed in earnest. Our investigation, however, revealed that most offices are still on the lock. Why the Edo State Commissioner for Justice, Barrister Henry Dagbo, believes that the Judson members should wait for the judgment of the court before grinding official activities at the court premises. The Judson member, on the other hand, are of the opinion that paralyzing activities at the court is one way to press on their demand. How this issue will be resolved? Only time will tell. From the High Court in Benin, I am Best Mbiere.